Hi there and welcome to this video looking at the structure of diamond and graphite. Okay, so in one of the previous videos we talked about the fact that diamond and graphite are both allotropes of carbon. What that means is they're both made up of carbon. So if we were to have a look at diamond here, you'll see that diamond is made up of four carbons surrounding the central one. And therefore every carbon atom has four strong covalent bonds. So graphite then, as we've already said, is an allotrope of carbon, so it is made up of carbon. The key difference between this and diamond is the number of bonds involved. So whereas diamond had four strong covalent bonds, graphite only has three. Now because there are only three bonds, it means that every carbon atom has a spare electron. And that's a key thing when we talk about the properties in a later video. And then the, the final thing that you need to know is that graphite itself exists in layers. So you have your three bonds and then there are layers between different sheets of graphite. Okay, let's have a look at two different questions then. So the first one should be fairly straightforward. How many bonds are there in every carbon atom for diamond and graphite? And then question two, other than the number of bonds, describe two other differences between diamond and graphite. So it says describe two of the differences, that means look at how they are different, don't just say this has this, this has that, show how they are different to each other. Pause the video, have a go, and we'll see how you've done them in. Okay, let's have a look at the answers then. So diamond, you should have got, has four bonds for every carbon atom, and graphite has three. And then for the second question, describing the two differences, the key things are mainly focusing on graphite, Every carbon atom in graphite has a spare electron, and graphite has sheets or layers. And you could have had the reverse argument, you could have turned around and said diamond does not have any spare electrons, or diamond does not have any layers. Okay, onto the review question then. What I'd like to do is compare and contrast the structure of diamond and graphite. And the clue for you is it's pretty much everything we've covered in this video. And that ends this video. Hi guys, hopefully you've enjoyed the video. If you have, click the subscribe button down below and visit the website mrbarnstc.com for more.